everyone, my name is Sarah and welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you are new here. I post videos every Monday, Wednesday and Friday so subscribe if you haven't already and let's jump straight into the video. So today I'm really excited because I'm going to put together two things that I recently got from Ikea. So I have a mirror and a clothing rack which I'm so excited for the clothing rack because for forever or long, however long I've been watching YouTube, I've been seeing all these fashion bloggers with their really nice clothing rack and they just have all their new in pieces on there and it's just beautiful and everything I've ever wanted. And here I am, a YouTuber, YouTuber I guess. I'm not there yet, I'm, I'm doing it, I'm getting there, but I'm not, not big or anything, not making a living off of it yet, but we will get there. But here I am, just little old me. And I, I bought a clothing rack and I'm going to put all my new clothing on there and just I really just want this to be a area of just like really big inspiration for me. I've been doing a lot of research into fashion. I've been on Pinterest like crazy. I've been really getting into just really looking into fashion a bit more rather than just styling things and I don't know I'm just really into fashion at the moment <laughs> if you can't tell how like excited I am about that so I am so happy to be finally having my own clothing rack uh, which I can just put all my inspiration on there and just look at it every day and it's just gonna be beautiful but today's video is going to be all about putting together the IKEA furniture so all the IKEA Kia things so even the mirror so this is the mirror here even that has to be screwed together but i will show you um what it looks like anyway so if you can see you're gonna like see like the mirror in the back uh the you gotta see the um camera in the background but it is this like rectangular little mirror here and it just as you can see from like there uh it just has like a little stand that it sits back on and i feel like it's just gonna be really cute um mainly for taking selfies honestly that's that's what i bought it for i'm probably going to um you may have seen a ram mirror i have that's like a rattan sort of woven one um which is sitting over in my bedroom over there um that i have there so i might move this one here and just sort of have um a different shape of mirror to take selfies in i feel like it's going to look really cool um for that so that's that's why i got it basically so yeah that is that it's just like um has like a timber edging here um and then the next thing is the clothing rack so it's all like in packaging and it's just a plain white stand up here um so it's just like a plain white uh and i think it just goes like up round and it's got like round edging um if you can see the little photo there that's what it's gonna look like and yeah it's made out of like aluminium it's definitely like metal and um such a good bargain but this clothing rack was ten dollars like how i i don't know i hope it's actually gonna like work uh i hope it's not gonna be like too flimsy or anything like that hopefully it's actually gonna do the job um, but yeah, this one was ten dollars, which is unbelievable. Um, and the mirror, I think, was like thirty, so a bit of a difference there. But I mean, considering this is like so much bigger, but I guess it is just metal, and the timber of the mirror would make it a little bit more expensive. So yeah, I'm just going to start putting this together now. IKEA furniture, as you know, is like so hard to put together sometimes. So we'll see how that goes. <laughs> Okay, so that actually wasn't too bad. I thought it was going to be really difficult, but it was actually pretty easy. I mean, to be honest, I did get back to help me uh, a couple of times, as you will have seen, but oh well. So. This is what the mirror looks like. So basically all I had to do was um, attach this part to this. So it was just like a couple of, um, it was just like a screw um, and like a little washer and then like a plate thing either side. As you can see, it like not, looks nice and neat there. And that is the mirror. So that is going to be really super cute. So I think, let's have a look. Let's, I'm going to pop it over here and then show you guys. Okay, so I've just popped it over here, which is like in this corner of my bedroom, other than the bits and tables. Um, so I feel like this mirror would be like really cute if you um, didn't really have like a lot of space and you sort of just have like a dresser and it would be like perfect for your makeup. So if I like kind of crouch down, 
I feel like that's like a really good, um, really good size. Just like get ready in the morning, do your makeup and everything like that. And I really like how you can like adjust the height, um, which is like what um, that's good for there. And then if you come back out like that, if it is sort of like chill up here, I thought that's going to be like super cute for selfies, which is everyone knows the main reason I bought it for. So I'm kind of planning on if I sort of... I don't know, I'm gonna like put it in like different areas, like maybe even like lay it flat and do like some really cool like product shots kind of thing. But yeah, I really like that. I feel like that's really super cool. So, or you could even just like have it sitting up like that and like not even like use the base, kind of have that as like a feature. Or I guess you could have that like on the top. But yeah, I'm really happy with that. That looks really nice. So yeah, this is the mirror I was talking about before um, that is usually, usually up there, but that's just. Yeah, I'm gonna have to play around with that a little bit and style that up. And here we have the main hero of the story. I feel like it's kind of hard to see because it's like all white, but this is what it looks like. To be honest, it did have some really bad reviews online, so I was a little bit skeptical, but for $10, honestly, like 14 year old me is like screaming. This is like, I, I'm just living for this whole situation, to be honest. Um, so I'm gonna style it up and I'm just so excited. Yee. like look at this color palette i am like i am completely obsessed like i'm actually <laughs> i'm actually getting emotional i'm gonna like move you guys up a little bit i feel like i'm actually getting emotional right now like this is honestly you know when you like have those moments you know like when you think you've had like your dream career come true or like you have like gotten into something you really wanted to do or you just like finally get what you want i feel like this is such a big I've made it moment, honestly, I'm such a small, like, fashion blogger or whatever you want to call me, but, like, this, come on, like, I, I just don't even know how to feel right now, like, it's something so simple, and for so long, I've, like, told myself, like, why should I have one, like, I'm not super successful, or, like, you know, everybody knows me or whatever at the moment, but can we just, like, yeah, I'm just, I don't know, I just feel like this is my... I've made it moment and like I'm so little and I'm just not even like I'm just I'm just me I'm just chilling but even just something simple that it cost ten dollars and it's just made such a big difference and I just I feel like this is gonna look so good in all my videos like say if this was like a haul kind of situation and I'm like here and I'm like showing you if you've watched anyone do hauls they're gonna have this they're gonna have something like that and then they're gonna be showing you pieces off the rack and just everything like that and it's just i'm just so happy and i don't know it's just something about this that makes me feel so so complete and it's so stupid it's such like a basic thing but honestly i feel i don't know i'm just so happy i finally got this and it was ten dollars and i just yeah it's made me so happy so moral of the story is go after what you want even if it is a ten dollar random as um thing from ikea i just want to look at it all day honestly i'm just like standing here like taking in all the goodness oh okay honestly i actually have no idea where i'm gonna store this i don't really have a spot for it that's probably a bit of a problem because it's kind of here right now and it's blocking off my bathroom and i don't think my boyfriend will like it just floating here so i'm gonna have to try and spot for it kind of thinking over here so i was kind of thinking on the, over there but then that's his side of the bed but you know i don't know I'm not really sure where I'm gonna put it. I might just leave it there and just walk around the other side of the bathroom. Who knows? Oh god. It makes me wanna cry. I'm so happy. <laughs> I don't know why. How beautiful is it? Can I put it over there? Can you put it what beside my bed? <laughs> what, to keep? Yeah. No. Where are we gonna put it? <laughs> okay, we we've we've done if you do that I've lost. <laughs> okay. There's still some form of something that I need to keep it. If mm -hmm. you put it over there, I've lost. Okay, well, where do I put it then? Hopefully in the bin. It's so beautiful. <laughs> can you put it? I'm sorry. Uh, <laughs> can you put it in there? I don't know where it's gonna. I might just put it in there in front of the, my desk. I don't, I don't use the desk. If you but put it in the study, it'd be okay. I just want to look at it every day. It's so pretty. It's not going beside my bed. Okay. Okay. I just thought it looks so pretty. It definitely wouldn't. In the mirror? It looked great in the bin. I don't like that mirror either. Mm. 
<laughs> Sorry. He even found the round one. He even found yeah. the woven one. Yes. That was very minimalistic, doesn't really suit the space. So I hope you really enjoyed this video and maybe got some inspo, even just like a cool way to like do over your room if like, if like you just don't have enough clothes storage or anything like that. Um, picking up something like this would be like a really easy and also really cute way just to um, style your room a little bit more. So thank you so much for watching and give this video a big thumbs up if you liked it and I will see you in my next one. Bye guys.